Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to just kind of casually sit down and do a video showing you guys how I apply my sea salt products. It's called Clarisy and it's like a sea salt solutions uh, kit. I have been getting a lot of blackheads lately, actually always. I'm really prone to getting blackheads in this area. I know it's like really common. I don't get any acne, but I do um, tend to break out, you know, once a month. If you guys catch my drift, know what I'm saying? During this time, uh, my skin gets crazy, acts up, and then I do get breakouts. Um, but blackheads is definitely something I struggle with all the time. So let's get started. I'm gonna show you guys how I use these products. The salt bar is basically something that you could use on your body or your face. This is better like for the body for me. Um, as far as bar soaps for my skin, I actually like to use a cleanser, something that will break up my makeup because you know, I cake it on. Then I have these two things which are the bomb. Clarice Sea Salt Solutions Rapid Detox charcoal exfoliant and the reason I like this is because charcoal actually dissolves your blackheads which is exactly what I need and it also has almond flour which brightens the skin so that's basically what I look for is something that's going to brighten because I am um, darker complexion if I do get breakouts it will scar if I try to mess with them and I get pigmentation so um, anything that is brightening, I usually tend to like gravitate toward. And the sea salt clarifies the skin as well. Basically, when I'm in the shower, I just have this little container. You're gonna wanna mix this with either your um, just regular water or your face wash. So I'm just gonna pour some of this into this container. I'm gonna mix it with some water. I think I added a little too much water. I'm gonna take this paste and then I'm just gonna apply it And you want to make sure to be really gentle with this. I never exfoliate around my eyes. Make sure to just stay away from this area because it's really delicate skin. Sometimes I like to bring this down to my neck and decollete area as well. But since I'm not in the shower, I don't want to get too crazy over here. You want to make sure to do this for at least a minute. Circular motions all around the skin, especially in your problem areas, which for me is my nose. It's getting everywhere. So I just got back and basically I just rinsed it off with warm water. Now I can obviously tell that my skin feels a lot softer. A dermatologist once told me that if you're using all these expensive creams but you're um, not exfoliating and you have all of this buildup of dead skin that all of those things aren't going to be able to penetrate the surface so it's basically like they're just sitting on top of your skin and they're not actually being absorbed so by exfoliating it's really going to help you so now i'm going to move on to a mask because my skin is ready to absorb whatever i put on it now i'm going to apply this deep pore detox mask scoop out a small amount and mix it with water until it creates a paste and then we're going to apply that to our face and let it sit for about five minutes. So once you've mixed it up and created a paste with this, you're going to just apply it to your face. Boom. So it's so funny because anytime I do do a face mask or a hair mask and I'm not in the shower, I'm just like doing stuff around the house, the mailman always shows up at this time. It never fails. And I always have to answer the door looking like crazy like this. So usually I would not have my eyebrows done, but you guys know the eyebrow struggle. Don't want to wipe that eyebrow off now. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. All right, so after you have that all applied and you look fabulous and you're ready for the mailman to show up so you could open the door looking crazy, you just sit there for about five to 10 minutes. It says five minutes, but usually I, you know, I never, I break all the rules, you guys. So I'm gonna leave it on for about 10 minutes because I'm a rebel. So I've let it sit for about 10 minutes. Now what I'm gonna do is go ahead and rinse everything off with warm water and I'll be right back. I just went ahead and rinsed everything off. Now you can go ahead and put on your moisturizer or anything else that you want and it's really going to sink into the skin. I do that process 
once every two weeks and it keeps my skin feeling a lot better. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're interested in any of the products that I used, go ahead and check the description box down below and there will be links and everything you need to know down there. If you guys wanna see a full skincare video, give it a thumbs up and I'll know that you would like to see that. I recently ran out of two of my products that I use all the time and I have to go repurchase them, so I didn't wanna make a video with everything and not include them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time, bye. that special time in every woman's life where, you know, it's just butterflies and white linen and you're running in white clothing through gardens. At least that's what the commercials say it's like, but it's not. God, sometimes I feel like really slow today. Powdery consistence. Consistence? Consistency. Ugh. Hey! Those dead skin skills. <laughs> See you next time, y'all! Yeah.